It's a glimpse into the future of Trans-Tasman Rugby League rivalry. The best of the best teenage talent. The Junior Kangaroos accepting the traditional challenge from their Kiwi counterparts. Plenty of NRL experience sprinkled across both sides, but it was the Ruse Eels connection who was first to shine. Tepo Baroa creates a man over, and Brinko Lee will score first for the Junior Ruse. Tepo Moroa set it up. Brinko Lee finished a dream start for the Green and Gold. But the Kiwis were quick to hit back. Docker Clay with numbers, a long ball. They have to find an opening. Surely Manu goes over. There's the try. Manu leaving three defenders in his wake to level the scores. But the Roos would again look to their NRL experience to keep their noses in front. Now Jennings. And Jennings has reached out to score. The Kiwis thought they'd done enough. Robert Jennings said, no, you haven't. But the Kiwis would work their way back into field position. The star 5'8", doing it all on his own. To Tamare Martin, who dummies, gets away from Maroa. Tamare Martin is over. The Aussies look set to head to the break, trailing by two. But star winger Valentine Holmes had other ideas. Valentine Holmes kicks and chases. It's going to be too heavy. No, it backs for Valentine Holmes. What a bounce to the Australian winger. It was like your perfect chip out of the bunker, plugging on the green, rolling back into the hole for Valentine Holmes. The junior Kangaroos leading the junior Kiwis 14 points to 10 at half time, but they wouldn't hold the advantage for long upon resumption. Tamare Martin again taking the line on and offloading. Back to Docker Clay. They create numbers, numbers big time. Watson Halita surges into the end goal and is swamped as Grant Atkins blows the try that could send the Kiwis back to the front. The visitors edging their way back in front, but a penalty awarded adjacent to the sticks would balance the equation once again. Here's Valentine Holmes drilling this one safely. The Kiwis would invite the Roos back into their own end with some poor discipline, and Tepai Moroa would carry his country back into the lead. Tepai Moroa at an angle, Tepai Moroa can't be stopped. The Roos hit the front again, and Tepai Maroa only had eyes for the in goal. The Aussies six in front and seemingly in control, but the Kiwis would snatch the ball out of mid-air. Only desperate defence from halfback Ashley Taylor shutting down the intercept. The Roos breathing a sigh of relief, but a turnover would invite the Kiwis back into the contest. And now the ball's been lost. Good pressure. Oh, They'll need cover defence again. This time the cover can't do the job. And look who's celebrating. Tony Tamusa. Zach Docker Clay had this from the sideline to level the scores. But it would drift wide. The junior Kangaroos defeating the junior Kiwis 22 points to 20. David Murdoch, NRL.